you and the family may be in the backyard with a ruler or something trying to measure the snow. That's right. Ben Derry tells us there's actually an official way, an official way to measure snow. I didn't even know about yeah, this. Yeah, believe it or not, it's more than just sticking a ruler into the ground. It, there's actually a bit of a process that we're going to be talking about. And what's the official thing that uh, meteorologists use? They use something called a snowboard. Not, you know, the one that you actually go down the hill with or go off jumps with an actual board that's painted white so it doesn't absorb heat from the sun. It's actually placed in a yard somewhere and you can see these little rabbit sticks right here so you can find it. And actually meteorologists will go in and stick a ruler on top of the board all the way so it reaches the ground and that's how they measure snowfall. It's cleared off uh, uh, once every six hours or so and that's how uh, meteorologists are doing that. And you can actually do the same thing. If you don't have a snowboard, you can also use a picnic table or a deck as long as as it's away from structures, it's got to be away from houses, fences, trees, things like that that would impact how much snow would actually fall. If you are going to be measuring on grass, make sure the grass is short. If the grass is a little bit longer, that will tend to inflate how much snowfall you actually measure because the snowflakes actually land on top of the grass. So when you stick the ruler down through the snow, you might actually be going all the way to the ground and not where that, the snow actual, actually starts. Make sure you take several readings, and if you do take several readings, Average them out in case you run into some that are higher than others. You want to make sure you get an average amount and you want to measure by the tenth of an inch. Here's an example of one place uh, that uh, did see some snowfall. This is from Tanith. Uh, you can see the uh, the porch right here. The the picnic table does have some snowfall on it. That'd be a good place to measure. But notice you have this little rooftop area right here. That might limit how much snowfall you see. So you might want to measure out into the yard as long as the grass isn't too long. Sherry sent in this picture. I would not measure near any of these larger trees or on the driveway, but in the middle of the yard away from any structures. And that is the official way how you measure snowfall. Jake? Good to know. That's a pretty handy ruler there, Ben. <laughs>